Welcome to HL Tutoring Services, Pause for Poetry. A time in the day when you can stop whatever you're doing, whether it's work or play, and listen to some poetry. How are you? I hope you're well and hope you've had a good week. Today, I'm going to be sharing a poem that's also a riddle. And I've chosen this because I know from when I've been traveling that um, Harry Potter is well known around the world. Wherever I've been, and if I say that I'm from the UK, people always say, oh, Harry Potter, Harry Potter, and they get really excited. So this is um, a riddle from one of the Harry Potter stories. And um, so I shall tell you at the end which story it's from. But if you are a real fan, I'm sure you probably know which one. So this is the Sphinx's poem. Are you ready? First, think of the person who lives in disguise, who deals in secrets and tells naught but lies. Next, tell me what's always the last thing to mend, the middle of middle and end of the end. And finally, give me the sound often heard during the search for a hard to find word. Now string them together and answer me this. Which creature would you be unwilling to kiss? So do you know the answer to this particular riddle? I'll tell you in a moment. If you think you might need some help or guidance from a qualified teacher, then please visit the website on hltutoringservices.com or leave a voicemail on 07950-598030. I can uh, provide help and or guidance uh, in primary education, English and maths, English as a foreign language for adults, or violin. So please get in touch. So, um, do you know the answer to this? So first of all, which is it from? It's from Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. So maybe you could have a look yourself and see if you can find the poem, and maybe find the answer. Or you can hear the answer now. So um, the answer is, first think of a person who lives in disguise, who deals in secrets and tells naught but lies. So that's a spy. And then next, tell me what's always the last thing to mend, the middle of middle and end of the end. So that's D, D. And then finally, give me the sound of often heard during the search for a hard to find word. So you get, uh, so that's ER. So you put it together, string them together and answer me this. So we've got spy. Uh, duh. Put it together, spider. Which creature would you be unwilling to kiss? That's a spider, but obviously spelled differently. So did you get that one right? I hope so. Did you like that poem? Did you like that riddle? Have you heard it before? Have you uh, read the other riddles in the Harry Potter series? There's quite a few um, in there and a few poems as well. So you could have a look if you like Harry Potter. If you've got a favorite poem, you could record yourself on video or you could just record your voice on audio and share it. That would be fantastic if um, you could send it and I could share it. Um, or if you want to make up one of your own, do that as well. Well, that's the end of today's Pause for Poetry with HR Tutoring Services. Um, let, thanks for your comments. Let me know what you thought. And tell me if you know any other riddles or other poems that are in Harry Potter. Um, or any other stories for that matter. Okay, take care, have a great week, and I look forward to sharing some more poetry with you very soon. Bye for now.